What's up everybody, Rod J back in the house. Thanks for swinging by to check out another video. Today I'm gonna check out one from Against the Grain out of Louisville, Kentucky. This is the Erogenous Roan. Yeah, the Erogenous Roan from Against the Grain. As you can see there on the bottle, this is a wild red ale aged in oak. Comes in at 6.8% ABV. Nice 16.9 ounce bottle. Doesn't really say too much else on the beer. There is a little bit of writing on that side, but I'm gonna go ahead and just crack this baby open. See what this one actually tastes like. And it says, as a summary, is much like a Flemish style red ale. So should get a little bit of a sour type action. Let's crack it open and check it out. Against the grain, make some really nice beers down there in Louisville. Shout out to Sam, that's one of the owners down there and uh, looking forward to seeing how they did with this one. So take a look at that. We've got it filtered before it goes to the glass, uh, to the bottle rather, before I put it to the glass. We've got a deep dark copper almost type color, I guess you can say, or deep dark amber, whatever it may be. I think it's more of a copper type look. You got the uh, head that sits kind of the eggshell white. Came out about two fingers, as right now it's down to about one, one and a quarter or so. So the head is dissipating rather quickly. Aroma wise, you're getting a pull of sour and tart on the nose. You think of the Flemish type style, that funkiness you kind of get there with the yeast and everything that's all involved in the, uh, what they actually do as far as the brewing of that type of style. All of that is coming out on the nose as well. You can easily tell it fits to that kind of fold. A little bit of an earthiness in there as well on the nose. So now we can actually see it's down to about a quarter of a finger or so. So it really does break down. And with this type of style, you're not gonna hold a head long. So that is just something that happens all the time. Get a nice sour tartness on the taste. Almost has like a fruit juice type feel to the beer. Getting a little bit of kind of a sour type berry type feel in there. You get a little bit of that earthiness in the taste as well. Um, you're not really getting any hop bitterness. You can feel it somewhat in the throat area. You can feel the carbonation a little bit. When you hold it, it sits on the tongue with a nice tongue prickling. You get a nice feel of a blast of the flavor in the mouth. I'm feeling a little bit of absorption there in the cheeks as well. So I'm getting a little bit of flavor there. Nice duration, hanging around nicely. I would say it's definitely more of your medium body type beer. And one you can kind of just kick back and enjoy. This wouldn't be a bad one to match up with some of the cheeses that are out there. So overall, a nice one that has a little bit of a juiciness in there as well. But a nice type of beer that has a nice style in regard to being a... Um, sour so to speak erogenous roan from against the grain definitely a nice beer or one i would say if you happen to see it, you are a flemish sour type fan to check out speaking of checking out thanks for checking out this video look forward to catching up with you guys soon if you've had this beer or any of the against the grain beers let me know what you think of them by leaving a comment below if there's other beers that you've had you want me to check out feel free to leave a comment on that as well and i look forward to catching up with you guys soon remember there's always time Get your beer on. Cheers, everybody.